Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Sick Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to turn on automatic downloads for your application so they're always updated when you're trying to use it on your iPhone. So you want to locate settings. So I can see it in the top left for me right here. So I'm going to select this. Then what I want to do is scroll all the way down until I can find App Store. So let's continue on down here under here. And there it is in the center of the screen. App Store, Red Web Wallet, and Apple Pay. So let's choose this. And then we can see automatic downloads. So we have app downloads automatically install free and paid apps purchased on other devices. So let's say you got an iPad. It's going to automatically down that onto your iPhone. So you can decide if you want that on or off. Then we have app updates automatically install new app updates. So definitely want that on. And then we have in-app content automatically run apps in the background to download content before you first launch them. So you can decide if you want that on or off. And then we have cellular data, automatic downloads. So probably want this on for cellular data too. I have an unlimited plan, so whatever I download really doesn't matter to me, so I am good. But if you do have a limitation on your account, maybe it's like 15 gigabytes or something like that, you may want to decide to just only download things on like Wi-Fi. So you can decide if you want that on cellular data or not. And then we have app downloads, always allow. And you can choose. And we have the option to ask of over 200 MB. Or you can always ask. I just set it to always allow. So it just keeps automatically updating in the background. So if you don't have the best internet plan for your phone, well, you have the options to only download things under a certain threshold. So things should be automatically updating now. And if they don't update, you can always go over to the app, Apple Store. So let's go on over to the left here and choose Apple Store. And then if you choose your profile picture in the top right and scroll on down, there should be an option now to just update the applications. And it looks like we don't have all these on. So I actually have to update some applications. So to get here, it's rather easy. You got your profile picture in the top right. Just scroll up and select that. And then you can scroll on down. And you can see everything that I need to update. So it says upcoming automatic updates right there. So I'm just going to update it before it automatically updates. So I'm just going to go to update all. And those are now updating. So you got Facebook, you have the little circle thing and the little square in the middle. Messenger's updating, Google Translate. So everything is updated under there. So good. So hopefully this video did indeed help you guys out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up. And subscribe my channel down below for more tech out videos coming up next on Your Six Studios.